I have been sweating like a dog today. My liver, my liver, <laughs> my liver is not happy. Uh, just a part of life. But I am sitting here and I'm with my sidekick. He's getting a haircut, and I have a shirt on him while I'm giving him a haircut because it works like a thunder vest for him. He gets very calm when he's in any kind of clothes. So I thought today, I'm going to put the shirt on him and see if it helps him relax some more because he does not like getting his hair cut. But, hold on. So far, he's got half done. This side not done. Look over here, bud. This side almost done. Look how pink his little face is. It's so pink, poppies. So pink. He is so, so pink. My oldest son is 30. And today, uh, he actually took my young son, his brother, to Hershey Park for me. Because I, I just couldn't do it. So they're at Hershey Park right now. And uh, that's why well, I get to actually kind of not have any responsibility. But I've really let my house... Because I've been getting teeth pulled for the last two months. So, two or three months. And... So, I've kind of let everything go to hell here. I just haven't taken care of my house. Or my dog. He usually gets baths every week. He hasn't had a bath in at least a month. Maybe a month and a half. He smells. You stinky puppies. You stink, mister. Mm. So, I'll give him a haircut. And, uh... He's stressed out. That's why he's panting. But if he cooperates, I could be done in an hour, but he's such a pain in the butt. He is always curling his feet in. He's like trying to hide every body part that he can. My bottom of my mouth actually feels slightly, blah, 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 <laughs> slightly better today. The sharp pain that I was getting seems like it has calmed down. Right here, there was a really, really sharp pain that kind of felt like a heartbeat going on there. I still feel it, but not as bad. So maybe whatever is there is starting to heal. Um, I noticed where she was, God, it hurts to talk. Um, I noticed where she was putting these bottom dentures on to try to fit some. Uh, it scraped off some skin in some areas, so definitely not going to put the bottoms in. I have two weeks before I have to go back to see her, and uh, I'm not going to put the bottoms in until it heals because it's just too delicate. It's gonna after the extractions heal, the dentures are gonna nick off skin because you know it's not normal to have plastic in your mouth so I know that's gonna happen anyway I'm still a little bit upset about the fact that my insurance said they don't care about how my um, dentures look as long as they fit that's all they care about um, so that's kind of upsetting also if they would have told me that I was gonna get different teeth I would have paid for the upgrade, but I had asked for another upgrade, and they told me, oh, you don't need that. So they knew I wanted to upgrade them anyway. I wanted to put a metal brace inside of the denture because I know that my mom's cracked in half, and now they put a metal thing in her new denture. So I thought, well, let's just put that metal in right off so that I don't have to deal with that. And uh, they were, she was like, no, 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 you'll never need that. So, um, I may contact the company, because it is a, uh, what do you call that? Like, McDonald's has different McDonald's everywhere. Um, so the dental place is a place that has other um, pop-up dental places. I can't think of what it's called. Um... So I think I am going to contact them about the fact that they didn't ask me if I wanted to upgrade or anything and I was told that the teeth were going to look just like mine and 
I know you're probably thinking, but your teeth don't look that bad. If you see what I look like before, it, I look like a totally different person. And that's what's upsetting. There's two things that are not like my teeth. And then they're wider than my jaw because I have a very narrow palate and they made them like I have a wide palate. So it's actually pushing my cheeks out. And um, so those are the things. I don't look like me. You know, I don't look terrible. I don't look hideous. But I just look like a totally different person than I did. And I don't, I don't like that. I think, I think they should have uh, met the, I was told certain things and now it's kind of like, you know, you've got crappy insurance so that you, you know, nothing you can do about it. But yeah, but I got a credit card and I can upgrade and I can do this and I can do that. I don't have a lot of money. I have a $500 credit card. Woohoo! But I could have borrowed. They have like a care plan and I could have borrowed on that or something. So, anyway, I'll show you what Bud looks like later. Are you going to look beautiful? Are you going to look beautiful later? Leave me alone, bitch. I don't like you. <gasps> Bud, don't talk to me like that. You know I didn't say that. That's you. You're saying those terrible things. I'm a good puppy. I know. I'm only playing. I know I'm nuts. I, it's just it's hereditary, probably. See you later. You gonna say goodbye? Mm -hmm. Okay, goodbye. I hope I don't lose any limbs. I want to see your other side. Look over here. Oh, so pink, 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 pink. I love this puppy. Your boy's gonna be so happy when he comes home and sees your haircut. Yes, you are precious. Okay, bye. I'm going to go get my hair cut now. I love you.